Hi everyone, let me give you a quick overview of the SAP automation capabilities of the UiPath test suite. To do that, let's switch to Studio Pro, our most advanced IDE for automation here at UiPath. Now in this project called the UiPath Banking App, you can see that there is already some exciting SAP automation waiting for you. Now, before I show you that automation in action, let me point out that from now on, UiPath is officially certified by SAP as a solution that provides robust, flexible, and fast automation for all SAP applications. To give you the proof, let me open here my browser and let me navigate to the so-called SAP Certified Solutions directory. And in that directory, you can search for UiPath. So let's do that. Now, once you did that, you see our logo here. When you click on the UiPath logo and scroll down a little bit, you see all three certifications UiPath has right now. So we have one certificate that acts as a proof point that we provide resilient automation capabilities for SAP S4HANA. We have a second one for the SAP Wingoi, and the third certificate is all about the SAP API, the so-called BAPI, the Business Application Programming Interface. So now let me show you what it actually takes to get such a certificate. So as part of that certification process, we had to prove to UiPath that we are able to steer their controls in their applications in a reliable and fast way. So we had to show to them that we can steer, for example, drop-down boxes, push buttons, radio buttons, uh, different types of uh, table controls, dialog boxes, as well as status bar, different types of grid view controls or tree controls, as you can see here, or text edit buttons, HTML controls, calendar controls, toolbar controls, checkpoints, or even generic objects. So this is what a tool vendor has to prove to SAP to get a certificate, in that case, for the SAP WinGUI. Now, on top of that, by introducing the UiPath test suite, we also provide pre-built SAP activities. So where do you find them? Well, just switch to the activities pane and then search just for SAP. And all these pre-built SAP automation activities are part of the UI automation package. And they definitely will help you to get started faster with SAP automation. So now let me show you such an SAP automation in action. And let me start with the SAP WinGUI. Now here I have a simple automated test case that creates a sales order in the SAP WinGUI. Now let's run this file and let's see what happens. So in that case, Studio collapses, then the robot launches. We also launch the SAP WinGUI. Then we select here the connection called UiPath. So this then redirects us to the logon screen. We provide our credentials. Then we enter the transaction code. And then we are basically ready to provide all the details that are required to create a sales order, such as the sold to party, the ship to party. And as you can see, we are even able to yeah, automatically interact with those weird tables in SAP. Then we verify here the status bar. We click on OK. We verify the net value. And then we log off. Now, once the execution completed, we can also go to the output of this automated test case, and we can then see that all of our verifications in that case passed. So that's the short story about SAP Wingo automation. In the same way, of course, you can automate any other user interface of SAP, such as, for example, the next modern interface of SAP S4HANA called the SAP Fiori. Now, let me show you that in action. Now here we have a simple automated test case called purchase item that uh, tries to purchase an item in the so-called SAP demo application. So let's run this file to see it in action. So in that case, again, Studio minimizes, the robot launches, then we launch the SAP Fiori demo application provided by SAP itself. You can see it's a very laggy application, but still we are able to uh, have no problems automating that application in a reliable and fast way. So in that case, we just want to purchase a smartphone. We provide here the cardholder's name, the card number, security code. We can even interact with uh, dynamic elements such as this button you have just seen. Then we provide the address details, click on the next step here, uh, say, well, we want to go for an express checkout. We fetch here the total price. We interact with some dialogues. We fetch the order number, and then we return to the shop and make sure that the card is empty. So that is how fast 
SAP automation, in that case, in SAP Fioris. And again, in the output, we can see that all of our verifications passed. Now, that's basically the short story of SAP automation here in UiPath. Now, as mentioned, we not only provide automation for SAP WinGUI and SAP Fiori, it also includes SAP the Java GUI, SAP Web GUI, SAP Business Client. So UiPath provides resilient, reliable, robust, flexible, and fast automation for all SAP user interfaces and beyond.